good neighbours look out for one another. But when your house burns down and they build you a new one, that's quite an act of generosity. Tradesmen have been working round the clock for the past number of weeks to get this two-bedroom cottage rebuilt. Last month, the uninsured thatched cottage of Melanie and Jeremy Zani went up in flames following a chimney fire. The blaze was brought under control, but their home and artisan bakery were completely destroyed. Even though, you know, the fire was a very, very terrible thing to happen, um, seeing the love and support from the whole community has been incredible and we haven't had time to feel sorry for ourselves. Now you're looking to something uh, as beautiful as the Tate Cottage and the love in it, you know. The neighbours are not just neighbours, they're superheroes. I love doing pl plastering for anybody that needs me. I am retired, but I will help out. All the local builders, carpenters, plasters, everyone here, give it's a great dig out, you know what I mean? Because they're a lovely family there, you know. They have a son here going to school with my young girl. Here. Morning, noon and night, two o'clock last night, the lads left here, you know what I mean, getting stuff ready, so they're moving in tonight, so as man said, it's just brilliant. The initiative was led by independent Roscommon Galway TD, Michael Fitzmaurice. What does it say about rural Ireland? Well, look, at rural Ireland, uh, many one talks about it being under pressure, but what it shows here, people working together, what they can do, it has shown the spirit that's in rural Ireland. Our spirit will never be taken away and our community will never go. Well, the thatch has gone, but the Zani family have a roof over their heads and the very best of neighbours. They say they're staying here for the long haul. Theresa Mannion, RTE News, Glenamadi, County Galway. <laughs>